A group of Kentuckians is raising awareness about Tourette's syndrome. Tyler Melito is here to tell us about their recent trip to Washington, D.C. to request research funding from lawmakers. It is estimated that more than 20,000 Kentuckians have Tourette's syndrome, and that number could be even higher due to a lack of diagnosis. Tourette syndrome is a neurodevelopmental disorder that causes various tics like twitching of the body or face, whistling, clicking of the tongue, or cursing. Claire Atkins and Megan Hurley were two of the people who went to Capitol Hill representing the Tourette Association of America, meeting with the staffs of Kentucky lawmakers like Rand Paul, Mitch McConnell, and Andy Barr. Their big push was for CDC funding specifically for research into treatment. Both Atkins and Hurley also learned how to be better advocates for the disorder in their own communities from people who experience the same struggles they go through every day. There's still so much that we don't know at the graduate level and teachers information that they don't know. And so our role being able to advocate for students, teachers, so they are caught up with our knowledge, hopefully will kind of shrink that gap but between people who have Tourette's and people who are diagnosed. And you would hear whistles and yells from all across the mm -hmm. room. And being in an, in an environment like that, where that's socially acceptable, where that's okay, where that's the norm, it was so comforting. Watching this probably don't think about Tourette syndrome on a daily basis, and Atkins and Hurley both say that lack of understanding has led to thousands of people who are undiagnosed. Coming up in the next hour, hear how their lives have been impacted by people simply not knowing about what they go through day in and day out.